call for a couple of black and whites. Get Fleischer down here. I thought you Marines were gung ho, Cole. You have a 45. Don't you ever want to use it? I'll take the back. Just give me a few seconds to get around there. LAPD, all of you are coming downtown with me. Throw out the guns. And it's the electric chair. I got you now, motherfucker. Let's clear the top floor. I don't want to get drilled on the back on the way out. Stay down. at the end. I heard something. All right, all right, don't shoot! Keep your hands up. Watch him, Bukowski. He doesn't move until I've tossed this place. Key Printing Company. <laughs> There's nothing like going direct to the source. Betting slip. Looks like Mr. Lightfall has been on a losing streak. slips here to keep them stealing cars till Christmas. We've got a trail of pink slips and stolen cars that leads right to your door, Bigelow. You're in this up to your neck, but I don't think you're the man in charge. Make it easier on yourself. Give him up. I do work on cars for customers. You charge in here shooting up the place like it's the Ballad of Bulge. I can't give you anything. We know about marquee printing. You can make this easier on yourself by giving us your man on the inside. I sometimes repair cars and put them back on the road. I need a pink slip to resell them. There's no problem there. There are at least four dead men in this warehouse. A couple more. Punks won't make for that much extra paperwork. You'd be doing the legal system a favor. OK, OK, tough guy. I get the message. Lightfall, the guy who runs Marquis. He's the big shot. He likes to spend big at the track. He owes people. Light ball. The guy with no luck at the track. Tell me about him. It's one of the guys lying over there. You're right. He has no luck. So 
So if I go over there and check his jacket, your story's gonna ring true? I'm warning you, Bigelow. Give it a try, Flatfoot. For some reason, none of my guys like to bring ID to work. Whether you give up your bosses or not, Bigelow, you're going away for as long as I can put you there. We'll see. I didn't fire a shot, Kappa. I just watched you tear my place up. they've been talking about on the radio you're behind the wheel uh where are we going what a mess uh gonna take some cleaning up that's for sure i wish it hadn't gone that way well they shouldn't bring guns to work with them we didn't have a lot of choice you have to admire the bare-faced cheek of someone who tries to blow your brains out one minute and then pleads innocence the next yeah, especially when he's surrounded by evidence. You know, guys like Bigelow spend so much time convincing themselves that they're not doing anything wrong that they actually start to believe their own bullshit. They get sloppy. Bigelow, Lightval, all of them. If they hadn't, who knows how long they could have kept this racket going. Complacency or greed. It's always one of the two that brings them down. You're under arrest. You again? This harassment is starting to wear thin. We found a box of pink slips in a warehouse full of hot cars. You signed for them, Lightbulb. I signed for all the orders and deliveries. You'll need something better than that, cowboy. Your money and influence will be worthless in San Quentin. If you don't go crazy in the first couple of months, then you'll probably get knifed in the chow line. Is that what you want? Save it for the suckers, detective. You'll get nothing from me. Gordon Lightvall, I'm charging you with conspiracy and fraud. Hands behind your back. Now where shall I start? With the two GTA suspects we had to let walk free? Or with a female suspect, who I am reliably told, slipped the leash with embarrassing ease. You just lost the chance to crack one of the biggest criminal operations in this city. How do you think that makes me look? The chief has my balls in a frying pan! Now get out there and fill some charge sheets. Misdemeanors if you have to. Get me something before I even think about giving you another case. 